तो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक अगेन एन एम यू ओ सिग्मा क्लासेस एंड इफ यू आर लर्निंग जैंगो देन दिस सीरीज इज फॉर यू ओनली एंड इन द इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ऑन हाउ वी कैन मेक आवर दिस टेम्पलेट एज यू कैन सी ओवर ऑन द स्क्रीन वी कैन मेक इट डायनेमिक राइट सो इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी वाज डिस्कसिंग ऑन द स्टैटिक पार्ट ऑफ दिस रजिस्ट्रेशन फॉर्म वी हैव फिक्स्ड इट विद आवर जैंगो ओके सो या सो लेट मी जस्ट शो यू once my code first so here you can see here in this uh, vs code we have this template right index.htm if you getting an, any error while fixing html like the same what i have did so then you can watch my previous video and you can start this video once again okay so in this lecture you can see here we are going to make three users so the 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 first user is the customer the second one user is the admin and the third one is the super admin right uh if suppose that for example you are a customer then if you will open this page then you will find the customer form okay and uh, for for example if you are admin then you will find admin form and if you are a super admin then you will find super admin form right so how we can do this how we can make the Uh, you know how we can make the checks and how we can basically so how we can change the text on the dynamic basis so let's get started so as you can see over on the page we have this registration form right so let me just do one thing here uh, let me just go inside my view.py file and this is as i can, as i can see here this is a hello world app we have and in this view.py file uh this is the index.html right so let me just create this first and uh, we have index.html because inside the urls.py you can see over here on this is blank is uh, you know blank is uh, blank space path i am calling my index view and in this index view you can see here this is our view this is our view right okay so uh, yeah so so you can see here we have the registration form right let me just search this registration form this is the heading if you will comment this like this and you will refresh this page you can see we don't have our our uh, we don't have our registration form label okay so let me just roll back the thing okay it is perfect fine so what we can do here uh, we wanted to make it dynamic if uh, for example you are a customer so this should be look like this customer form okay c should capital here and when you refresh this page you can see here we are we are getting the customer form and if you are an admin then it should look like this admin form refresh this page you can see admin form right okay perfect so let me just do this thing by uh this file view.py right so here in this you can see we have the indexed file and this is the python code right okay so we can make a dictionary over here and in the dictionary we can make a key so let's say type user or we can say user type okay and we are defining user type here for example customer customer okay so this is our dictionary right so our index.html file it uh, like basically can access this dictionary so let me go just go inside the index.html page and where we have the register registration okay what we have done previously okay so as you can see here we have the customer right so previously it was it was registration form right like this and just need to pass my user type over here only okay once you will done this okay so just recap the thing for once, once again we just go inside the view.py file so the very first step you need to define your dictionary over for example we have the user type key and we have the value is customer so this user type value you can access inside our index.html uh, on the basis of uh, when you will define your index.html so this is you can see we have the user type customer we have defined here right so this user type key you can access inside this index.html right so yes so we have you can see here user type so let me just check once again this refresh this page you can see customer but 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 we want to see we want to show the user is uh, not only the customer we wanted to show something different we wanted to show uh, 
type of the user and form right form it's a form so just uh, refresh this you can see who are we are getting the customer form right so you don't need to worry to change inside the index.html page because this will fix this will be static but only we are using the jinja pattern over here and uh, we just need to change here inside this view.py because this is our python code and uh, uh, whatever the business logic you wanted to, you wanted to uh, develop you can uh, develop under inside this view.py file you you are admin admin type you are admin if you for example if you are admin then you can type here admin and this index.html when you will you know refresh your page then you can see admin form okay another one if uh, you have the super admin then you can define like this super admin then refresh this page okay you've got an error no 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 just refresh this page once again and then you can see here super admin form so like this you can basically change your you know html file dynamically because uh, here you can change uh, the layout the color the text then the page uh, everything you can change on the dynamic basis but uh, as of now we are interested to um, change only the text on those dynamic basis we wanted to make the this text dynamic okay so at the moment when i'm saying dynamic we need to change something here inside this view.py so we need to add dictionary over here right so in the next lecture we will discuss about like how we can use our models.py file and using this model.py file how we can insert the data in a huge in a very huge amount okay so um, in the next lecture also we will you know when we will submit the form then we will able to see our you know um, the home page so, so the moment when you will click on the submit button then you will be able to see your home page right okay so what we have learned in this uh, tutorial let me recap the things once again to you uh, okay so we have this index.html page okay so we have downloaded that template from the google and we will we we have fixed it with our django and uh, you can see over here we we uh, the previous one was the uh, registration form right so we wanted to make uh, uh, the text dynamic so we made some changes here inside this view part and you can see over here we uh, we can see here we have this dictionary so under in this dictionary we have the key called user type and uh, in this key we are setting the value is the user admin over here if you will change this key value right so then you will get difference difference you will get your value under inside this you know jinja pattern user type okay so you can see over here we have set uh, this super admin then you can see here is super admin form i hope you like this video give give it big thumbs up and please like share subscribe this channel so that i'll make more videos on it Thank you so much. Thank you so much once again.